31, we're going to determine whether the series is convergent or divergent. If it's convergent, we're going to find its sum. All right, um, so I'm going to uh, uh, condense this with summation notation and write this as n equals 1 to infinity, and this would be 1 divided by 3 times n. Now, uh, this also can be, uh, the one-third can be uh, pulled out and written as uh, the sum from n equals 1 to infinity, and this would be 1 divided by n. So basically, uh, this series is just a constant multiple of the harmonic series. This is your harmonic series, and it diverges. So for this video, what I was going to do is show you why this uh, harmonic series diverges. So we already know it diverges, and we can, uh, let's, don't worry about that one-third. And I'm going to show you why this uh, diverges. And for this um, series, let's consider partial sums. So S sub 2, S sub 4, S sub 8, S sub 16. I keep multiplying um, by 2, or it's going to be 2 to the 4th. Then 2 to the 5th is 32, um, dot, dot, dot. So... We're doing all the ones that are s uh, subscript 2 to the nth power. All right, so when you do your partial sums, you're going to get s sub 2, which equals 1. Uh, if you substitute in 1 here, your, let's write this out a little bit. This is your first sum um, plus term 2. So this is going to equal 1 plus 1 half. All right. Now, we're going to check this one. So S sub 4 is basically uh, your sum, uh, partial sums of 3 plus your fourth term. Now that equals 1 plus 1 half plus 1 third plus 1 fourth. So that's what that would be. And what we want to show is that our partial sums um, are going to become larger and larger. So what we're going to do is make this greater than uh, 1 plus 2, 1 half, plus, instead of 1 third and 1 fourth, we're going to write 1 fourth plus 1 fourth. All right, so we're comparing these two. Let's do these two. So that makes it larger because one third plus one fourth is larger than one fourth plus one fourth. This side actually equals one plus two divided by two. And there's a reason I'm writing it uh, this way. All right, so we have this one and we have this one. Now let's do our S sub eight. So that's just going to equal Instead of writing all of this, I'm just going to write 1 plus 1 half plus uh, your 1 third plus 1 fourth. Okay, so that's the first part. And then your next term would be um, 1 fifth plus 1 sixth plus 1 seventh plus 1 eighth. Now we're stopping at the eighth here. And we're going to show that this is greater than um, 1 plus 1 half plus, um, and let's uh, erase this part. Uh, for this right here, we have uh, 1 fourth plus 1 fourth. And we're going to change all these to the subscript 8. So this is going to be 1 eighth plus 1 eighth plus one eighth plus one eighth. Now this right here is going to equal one plus three halves because this actually equals one plus one half plus one half plus one half. Now do you see a pattern? We're going to have uh, one plus one half, one plus two halves, one plus three halves. So when we do the 16, 
that one should be 1 plus 4 halves. So let's do that. We're going to do S sub 16. That's going to be 1 plus 1 half plus 1 third plus 1 fourth plus, I'm going to squeeze all this in, uh, 1 fifth plus dot 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 plus 1 eighth. Then we had plus, the next one's going to be 1 ninth plus go all the way to dot 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 plus 1 divided by 16. Now this is going to be greater than, and we copy this down, 1 plus 1 half plus, now we're going to change this, so this will be 1 fourth plus 1 fourth, and this one we already did, this was 1 eighth plus 1 eighth plus 1 eighth dot dot dot, let's just go to plus 1 eighth and this one we're going to write with 16 in the denominator. So this is going to be 1 16 plus dot 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 plus 1 divided by 16. Now this one is going to be uh, equal to this one here. Uh, 1 plus 1 half plus 1 half plus 1 half plus 1 half. So we have 4 1 halves. So this equals 1 plus 4 halves. All right, so now if we did S sub 32, this one is going to be greater than 1 plus 5 halves. S sub 44 is going to be greater than 1 plus 6 halves and so forth. So that means our uh, sum subscript of 2 to the power of n is greater than 1 plus n divided by 2. That shows that our sum of subscript 2 to the power of n, as it gets larger and larger, as n gets larger and larger. So our sequence, our harmonic sequence is divergent. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.